Okay, so if you're not new to my channel, you may know that a few weeks ago I made a video on this guy called Jack G. If you don't know who Jack G is, um, I, I, I don't really know either. But basically, he's this guy that pretends he's a famous rapper, I guess. An example of something he's done in the past is renting out a Rolls Royce and barricading off a walkway. So people just walking down the street look like his fans, even though they had no idea who he was. And he's also got an Instagram, which uh, is something else. So to start off, his username is Hottest Boy Alive, which uh, is a definite red flag. And there are also many, many, many other red flags on his Instagram. His profile is essentially just one big red flag. Most of his pictures are just him with expensive clothes or cars. But there are some showing off things like custom bed sheets with pictures of his face on. And uh, he also bots the majority of his comments as well to say things like Hot Boy Jack G and You're So Dreamy Jack G. <laughs> but things get weird when you realise this guy has a fully registered company. And also, you got to think like, why is he doing this? What does he get out of this? It's so confusing. Like, you might initially think that he's obviously a troll, but if he is, he's been keeping up this act for over four years now with essentially no recognition whatsoever. Now, as I mentioned at the start, I made a video on this guy because it, it was just too good not to. And he's fired back at me with a response video that looks like it's been filmed in his mum's cupboard. Now, before I get into watching his response video, I'm just gonna show the Instagram post he made a few days before posting it. Breaking, it's the video the entire world has been waiting for. I am offering the entire world the greatest reaction video the world has ever had the pleasure of seeing. Since Bebeless has made a video about me, his videos are going viral. Due to my fame, wealth, and popularity, my video is not free. But I'm not heartless. I realize Memeless fans' money is somewhat limited, so I've kindly made the money pool a mere thousand pounds. Now, I never got to see the money pool because I've literally only just found this post. But I doubt and really, really hope no one donated a grand to him to see this. Also, I'm just gonna say this now before we get into looking at his video. When I censor parts of this video, it's not a dig at Jack. I'm only gonna be doing it because YouTube will probably demonetize it if I don't censor it. So yeah, I just wanted to clear that up before we got into this video. But yeah, now I've got that cleared up, let's just jump into this. I think we should clarify something to begin with, you done dig. I'm not a YouTuber. Okay, I'm not a YouTuber. I find these YouTubers lame. I make videos, I make money and music, you feel me? Now, although I agree YouTubers are lame, we probably spend about 90% of our time just sleeping or crying. I gotta ask, where does this guy upload his music then? He's definitely not uploading it on Earth because no one's ever heard of him. Like, does he just have some kind of alien fan base and he just transmits his music in space? Because at this point, that's the only possibility. We established... There ain't gonna be no editing in this video. Now, when he says there's gonna be no editing in this video, he he really means it. You'll see what I mean in a sec. I'm finna make a reaction, cuz it my fans want. I'm finna make a reaction, cuz it's my fans want. Alright, nice one, Jack. Lyrical genius. Cuz you see, since Memolus made a video about me, <laughs> his subscribers went up. He did. His viewers went up. He got like 1.2 million views. Yeah, because it's not like the video second previous to that one got nearly 3 million views. And the one after it got nearly 2 million views. Yeah, Jack, yeah, you, you definitely made me. I'd be nowhere without you. I mean, his popularity was going down. Then all of a sudden he make a video about more fucking Jack G. Everyone talking about it, you feel me? Oh yeah, I, I was on my way out before Jack G came along. I'll forever be grateful for what he has given me. Oh no, this gonna be the greatest reaction video. No, he says it's going to be the greatest reaction video of all time, and uh, the whole thing's out of sync. Come on, this is something really special, and I, it, it can... Could... Like, I'm going to do literally the only job he had to do, and sync up my video for him. Okay, so, um... I'm here with Will. Hello. Like, I never normally bring anyone Leverage, else in this type of video. Now, I didn't think I would agree with anything you said here, Jack. But what you just said there is absolutely spot on. Couldn't have said it better myself. He's just told him because he's hungry. But I need, we need a bit of context. I don't get... I don't know... Like, hang on. So, actually, there, I don't know the context Memolus doesn't like, wait, come across as very intelligent. Not, Excuse me, mate. Who are you calling not intelligent? I have, like, 9 or 10 GCSEs and a couple of BTECs. And I was put on the golden wall in year 4. So, yeah. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> That's <laughs> racist. What? what? <laughs> There's a picture here. <laughs> He's got himself printed on yeah, his Yeah, my bed sheet looks good as fuck. There's something going on here. I don't like, get it. Oh my god, I need those bed sheets. Ah! Oh, what is this? They be like, I need these like bed sheets. Like you do. Yeah, Jack, I need those bed sheets. Please tell me where I could get them. My current bed sheets are late. Whenever I bring girls back around my flat, which is. Uh, 
all the time, trust me. Laura's like, oh, no, nah, Mimi, you're, you're lame. You haven't got Jack G on your bed sheets. So if I bought water on eBay, sorry, it gone, it gone sell. You did, it really gone sell. Yeah, it was probably just Big Al that bought it all, to be honest. You can't get enough of the stuff. 99% sure he's made this account himself. <laughs> he just, like, replies to his own Oh, I'm sorry, yeah, Memelis, that you've not got any yeah, fans, yeah, and you racist. <laughs> I think that why you got no fans, you dig? Oh, yeah, definitely, because as soon as Will said that guy's name from an obviously fake account, my entire fan base turned on me. No one on earth left watching the Memeless YouTube channel. I'm going to be real. I feel Memelis has discriminated against me because I'm part of a black community. Oh, 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 no. Yeah. To <laughs> that's cheap. Oh, that was giving my fans a good price. Oh, that's so honourable of you, Jack. Only seven and a half grand for a feature. Incredible. You're practically giving it away. Also, if you guys want me to feature on one of your videos, since I like you guys, I'll give you a good deal. 20 grand and I'll do it. Be quick, though. Usually it's 50. Wait, what well, what happen if you ring the he's number? Just, is he okay? <laughs> of course they're there for me. The fuck? Oh, sorry, Jack. I didn't know. Pretty hard to tell since none of them seemed to know who you were, and most of them didn't even really acknowledge your existence. Like there were people at the start of your own video asking if you were famous. Is he behind you? Like if someone at your fan meetup or whatever has to ask if you're famous, then uh, they're probably not there for you. But then he finishes watching my video and then summarizes the whole thing. All I can say to summarize up this beer is shout out my Versace ring. <laughs> shout out my Versace glasses. Oh, that, that that's, a, that's a great summary, Jack. Don't say anything about the video, just uh, talks about his ring and glasses. To be fair, he is the greatest rapper alive and the hottest boy ever, so he, he doesn't even really need to give a summary. We're just blessed by having him on our screens. You know what? Shout out to Memulus, you dig. Don't give Memulus no hate. Oh, thanks for saying that. I was very scared that Jack G Army was going to come over and obliterate my channel. But I'm just not like... You dig the racism side of Memulus discriminating against me because I'm black. Okay, I, I I don't know where he's gathered this from. It's just as though he's pulled it out of thin air. Knowing this video for some of the things, he's probably trolling. I mean, at this specific point here, it's pretty obvious he's trolling. I mean, uh, I hope he is. But uh, I'm still not sure about all the other stuff he's done. Like, this guy's been dedicated to this for years. And he's had, like, next to no recognition whatsoever. Like, I'm kind of failing to see what he's got out of this in the previous years. To me, it's just looked like he spent a lot of money renting out a Rolls Royce and buying Instagram comments for no real reason. And also... He set up a company around this whole fake thing, which just makes it about 50 times more confusing. I wouldn't try and compete with me. You see, I don't got the money, power, and fame. Oh, mate, I, I am trembling. I completely forgot Jack G was in the top five most powerful people in the world. It was a huge mistake messing with him, and I deeply regret it. I'm sorry, Jack. Please forgive me. But um, it, it didn't stop there. He uh, he also dropped a diss track on me called Memeulous a Lame. And uh, I think we should just give this a listen to see the inner workings of Jack G's mind. I am Jack G. Jackie, Jackie, you wish Jackie, you was Jackie, me. Jackie. You wish you was me. Like, th this guy just reminds me of the human incarnation of Cartman from South Park. J just tell me Jack G isn't exactly like him. Jackie, Jackie. I am the hardest boy alive. I am the hardest boy alive. Okay, now the first section of the video is absolutely nothing about me. It's just him saying how I want to be him and he's really hot. Like, yes, Jack, we gathered you're the hottest boy alive by your Instagram handle. We don't need you to keep repeating it. I'd say about half of the song has nothing to do with me. J just listen to this. Pull up in a chiropractor. I'm hotter than a tractor. I'm hotter than a bacter. I it's hard to make videos about stuff like this because it's so shit, it's hard to just not point out the obvious. I can see now why he pays people to enjoy his music. But then towards the end of the song, things begin to take a, a, a bit of a dark turn. You see all your little broke fans. Genocide. Genocide again. Um... I think some of you might have touched a nerve a bit. Like, he's literally talking about committing genocide on my fans. What? <laughs> Why? And he says genocide again, as if he's done this before. But despite my video on him, Jack G is still going strong, uploading videos like Jack G, the hottest and richest boy alive, where he um, just shows a video from a while ago of him pulling up in a Rolls Royce and standing around with music in the background. A lot of people hate me, but still they I, I, I'm not sure what the purpose of this video is, but it's art nonetheless. 
Right, but anyway, guys, that is the end of today's video, and I hope you did enjoy. As always, please don't send any hate over to Jack G. One, because it, he'll commit genocide on you, and two, because it, it's just unneeded. But yeah, anyway, guys, as I said, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, be sure to subscribe and smash that like button.